In Germany, it has long been recognized that depending on the structure, it is not always possible to take cores to determine the compressive strength. For this reason, they have developed a method which has been used successfully for many years now, which enables an in-situ strength estimation using a rebound hammer without any correlation to cores. The European standard EN 13791 is used to determine the characteristic compressive strength. This is a fifth percentile. Basically, 95% of the concrete in the structure will be stronger than the characteristic compressive strength. This is the safety factor which allows us to determine the strength using the rebound hammer test alone. The default method is to take 18 cores distributed throughout the test region and to determine the characteristic strength based on the crush test results. The alternative method requires a minimum of nine test locations. At each test location we have to determine the rebound number and then we need to determine which is the smallest rebound number and also the median of all rebound numbers. Now we can use these test results with the lookup table provided in the standard. The smallest R value, the median for the test region, and that gives us the compressive strength class. This method is integrated into the Schmidt Live app, both in the iOS and Android versions. We start by selecting our measurements. From here we can generate the report. We begin by selecting all of the measurements in the test region and then export EN 13791. The report is generated automatically and we can send it via email to our colleagues located back in the office or indeed anywhere else. Here we can see an example of the test report. Let's zoom in and have a look. As you can see, the app has identified the lowest rebound value, it's calculated the median for the entire test region, and it's assigned the compressive strength class. So a complete test report in practically no time.